Home buyers looking to own waterfront properties should keep a few things in mind, as in real estate of mine. We're happy to have Scott Larimer from Coldwell Pacific Banker Pacific Properties here with us to find out more about that. Good morning. Good morning, Tanya. Good morning. Before we jump to that, I have to ask you about this prospective Lanai sale. It has to be the big buzz in the real estate world right now. It, it is. I mean, it hit really fast, came up quickly. All of a sudden, it was speculation it was going to happen, and then the next thing we knew, it happened. So, uh, or it seems to be on track. And uh, in general, I think every one of us as real estate agents would love to have been part of that transaction. <laughs> oh yeah, commission, hello. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, you know, in, in the market of waterfront properties, those are selling for a pretty nice clip too. So uh, what are we talking about when you are looking for something on the market? Well, waterfront properties, I mean, we don't have a lot of land that mm -hmm. we can develop here. And waterfront is one of those that's really that we're even more so restricted. We can't. Uh, there's not a lot left to develop, and uh, keeps us keeps that market strong. So it keeps the values of waterfront. Your waterfronts, your oceanfront, your sandy beaches, mm -hmm. and then also marina front listings. Right now we have out of a th about a thousand and fifty active single family home listings. Only around just over a hundred of those are waterfront properties. Well, I believe we have an example of a water pro property that's right now currently on the market in Hawaii Kai. Tell me more about that one. Yes, it's a, uh, a listing that's uh, 1,985,000 mm -hmm. and uh, five bedroom, four bath house. It is marina front. It has uh, a pool that fronts to the marina side. Mm -hmm. So you've also got great views across the marina. It's a wider part of the marina. So when you're looking across the marina, you don't have neighbors directly across from you, so you don't have to worry about sound traveling, which does sound does travel across the water easily. Obviously, someone who could afford that, not necessarily enticed or needing those big loans, but the low interest rates have got to be moving some of these homes right now. Yeah, I mean, we're seeing good purchasing power for our buyers. So the low interest rates, we have low inventory right now across Oahu. Mm -hmm. That's one of the big things you're going to hear everybody speak about is low inventory. So that helps helps the sellers in some neighborhoods. It depends on which what neighborhood you're in. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, we'll always have those real estate tips for you. Thanks so much for joining us today.